Crypto Lightsaber back with another video, guys. A few weeks ago, you may have seen me talk about the Lunatic token. Right, guys? At the time, it was sitting at around 3.8 million in market cap. This is the video right here. And the chart hadn't really done much yet, but uh, it was sitting at a decent market cap. Okay, guys? And um, since then, we've almost doubled. Uh, well, we, we've more than doubled. Well, we've almost doubled in market cap. Um, so it's about 100% gain. It did have a dip initially all right guys it did have a dip it went up and then it had a dip uh, but you've got to expect dips when you see these kind of rallies right um but ultimately we're looking at the long term short to mid term uh you know in some cases sometimes long term potential of these projects i always say that a long term hold can easily become a short term hold if this did like 100x 300x something like that you know in a week for example uh, you might have gone into it thinking it's a long term hold goes up 200 300 x you're going to take profit all right guys because it's going to be it's going to quickly turn into a short-term hold and if you really do see it as a long-term hold after that you can always buy the dip with some of those profits because it will most definitely dip okay guys but lunatic token the ticket is lunatic all right guys if you didn't see my previous video this is basically a it's, it's, it's a token by the Luna community, and you actually get reflect rewards in Luna, LUNC, which is Luna Classic. Um, but it's on a Binance Smart Chain, so on a Binance Smart Chain, it's just called Luna. Uh, but you actually get these rewards, and they're also burning tokens. I think they've done 250 million token burns so far. And of course, you can follow them on Twitter and all that sort of stuff. You can actually come straight to the website and buy it through the, the, the Rubik um ui on their on their website the taxes are 10 percent. okay so it's 10 percent in 10 percent out but of course like i said they're doing the burns right um and um yeah obviously uh, the aim is to help the price of luna classic because obviously these guys are lunatics um and yeah i mean it started off 100 billion token supply so obviously the token supply is going to be reducing over time so if you didn't know what this is and you want to know a little bit more about it make sure you do your own research and none of this is financial advice by the way don't risk more than what you can afford to lose but it's basically a fan token um in regards to luna but it's got its own unique tokenomics okay guys and it's uh you know it's uh it's going up right so i mean one thing i like about this token is community uh if you can leverage the luna community into a meme coin for example lunatics token um we could potentially see some huge gains in this right this may soon overtake 10 million market cap it's 7 million at the moment just over 7 million so and it's breaking into price discovery so what is the potential for it that's what we have to look at all right guys so if you would have bought the token when i called it out you would have been in a profit despite having to wait a week or two for the gains to come back after this little pullback uh, but you know these things are expected and we're going to see lots more pullbacks along the way sometimes i get messages asking why has this token gone down why is this dumped or whatever i don't get them when it's going up they're just like yo it's mooning right but um, charts don't go up in straight lines. That's something you have to remember. You have to decide whether you're willing to hold something. Don't risk more, uh, more than what you can afford to lose. And uh, be comfortable with, you know, whichever direction the chart goes. And kind of not let it affect you mentally, for example, right? But there's a lot of newbies in the space. Uh, they're not really expecting the dumps. They just expect the pumps. But charts don't go up in straight lines. This is a prime example. And I can show you, I mean, show me a chart that goes up in a straight line. If it does, I definitely won't buy it because you're probably buying the top. And a, a dip is coming somewhere along the way. All right, guys. So, of course, be aware of the taxes. A 10% buy, ta uh, 10 buy tax. 10% sell, uh, sell tax, okay guys, but if we jump into the Telegram, right, so the community is a pretty, I'm already, where is it, okay, so the community is a pretty based community, 6,330 members, right guys, and this is where it's all going off, right, um, at the end of the day, right, a lot of people in Telegram hype things up, right, so you can't buy just based on Telegram hype, right, but um, a lot of times, when you look at this, I normally look at the size of the community and engagement of the the engagement of the community, right? Um, if I go to sleep tonight and I wake up and there's thousands of messages in here that are unread, you're going to get a lot of this rubbish, right? You're going to get all of this. It, it, a lot of it means nothing, right? But ultimately, what it does mean is community engagement, 
Like people are trying to hype it up. So if I woke up in the morning, there was only like a hundred messages. Or I woke up in the morning, uh, and there's another coin that with three thousand messages that I haven't looked at. Right, um, I'm probably gonna go with the one that's got three thousand because I'm gonna say, you know what, this one's got more community hype. So the Lunatics token is definitely a contender for some more gains, and it looks like it's gonna break out into price discovery. So you have to kind of use that information to your advantage. All right, guys, um, the best place to buy it would have been over here or over here but at the end of the day you can never time the bottom you can never time time the top it's not about timing the market sometimes it's about time in the market the saying goes and um yeah i wonder what results this can produce uh short term mid term long term i don't know do your own research make all your own decisions all right guys but don't risk more than what you can afford to lose once again none of this is financial advice just showing you what i'm doing showing you the tokens that i'm interested in right i posted this um i posted this to the r2r chat um earlier let's have a look um because you know i've called out quite a few uh, quite a few good tokens and they're all performing right so squid grow of course you guys know that i'm a squid grow uh you know i'm, I'm a squid grow investor right nothing more to be said Cairo been going up, um, Sinu, uh, Shepherd Inu going up, Elunity, all right guys, these are just a few of the recent calls I've made over July, August, making bullish gains and new highs right now, this doesn't include some of the others which are on pullbacks and so on, uh, that's not even, let me edit that, should be pullbacks not uh, pullbacks, right, um, but yeah, I mean, and where are these getting called out? Not They don't all make it to video, right? If you jump into the Crypto Insomniac Telegram group, this is where I'm calling out this stuff, all right, guys? So you can come and get it here. Uh, there's other projects that people are calling out in here. There's another one that um, looks good. Where is it? This one, what's it called? White. Um, well, yeah, that's another, that's another conversation. Whether it makes it to video, I don't know, but it does look pretty bullish. But yeah, guys, if you join the Crypto Insomniac Telegram group, um, yeah, this is where I am. Uh, this is where we are. You know, this is what we're doing, right? We're making gains in a bear market. Okay, guys. So uh, you can see the Cairo chart there. All right, guys, come and join us. Um, link is in the description. It's a free group, so take advantage. That being said, it is the end of the video. Lunatics token looking very bullish, all right, guys. Let me know what you think in the comments. Uh, do me a favor and subscribe to the channel. Tick the little bell for notifications. If you like the video, that will help with the YouTube algorithm. And um, yeah, YouTube will begin to recommend my content to people that may not see it otherwise. And that being said, thank you all for subscribing to the channel, supporting the channel, and I will see you in the very next video. Thank you.